Today we'll be enabling the ViewAll2 plugin for Milestone XProtect clients. To do so, you'll need Milestone XProtect 2018 R1 or later, and ViewAll2 Pro 2.12.0 or later with the Milestone plugin feature. First, log into the Milestone Management Console and find Basic Users under the Security heading. Then click Add New Basic User. Next, click Roles and right click and add role. We'll be adding an OnVIF bridge, so I've named my role OnVIF. At the bottom of this panel, click Overall Security. Look for the Cameras item and click Deny All. Then selectively allow the Read, View Live, and Playback permissions. Next, scroll down to the OnVIF Bridges item and again deny everything, then allow only read permissions. Now click Users and Groups, then Add Basic User, and select the user we created in the previous step. Next, under the Servers heading, find OnVIF Bridges. Right-click and add a new OnVIF bridge. Here too, we'll input the same user as before, and click Add User. Save changes when prompted and return to view all two. Connect to the video wall and find the video management systems button under the server settings menu. Click the VMS client plugin button and enable the client plugin. Optionally, select a control panel to make available from within the XProtect plugin directly. Finally, log into the Milestone XProtect Smart Client and navigate to the new ViewAll2 tab. Enter the address of your video wall and connect. Go to the gear icon in the plugin and enter the IP address of your milestone server as well as the username and password we created in the previous stage. Now the plugin should have access to all milestone cameras as well as every other type of video wall source like layouts, web browsers, and more. You can drag and drop sources to the wall and move them directly. Or click the presets button to view the control panel and launch pre-configured layouts and scripts. That's all there is to it, so thank you for watching, and for more information, find us online at viewall.com.